What's up guys? This is a Chevy Blazer EV and we're going to do a little test using an EV goer level one charger that plugs into a 110 wall outlet. Gonna leave this thing charging overnight and see what kind of range we gain. So let's go check out the charger. We'll pop the trunk here and grab this thing out of the box. So this is an EV Goer J1772 charger, which is the style of plug, kind of the standard that plugs into most all electric vehicles aside from Tesla's. Let's take a look. All right, so open this up. Grab this nice little bag out of here, little travel case, carrying case. Unzip this. And here we go. So here's the charger, charging cable, along with some wall screws if you want to mount this thing to the wall, you're able to do that. And then there's also the 240 to 110 converter cable. So it comes with this angled prong here, which I believe you can only plug into a 240 volt socket and then by plugging this adapter into it that comes with the charger you're able to convert it to just a regular 110 so plug into pretty much any standard household outlet that you would have i right, taking a look at the charger here this is the box that you can mount to the wall if you would like there's a little hole right here and then it shows you what some of the different lights mean on the front of the charger so when you plug it in should turn to this blue mode for standby. If it's charging, flashing green, charge complete, it'll be green. And then also gives you some of the specs down below here as far as max output, input, voltage, that kind of thing. Let's plug this thing into the wall first and then into the car and see how it goes. So doing this one-handed here, so bear with me. But we'll plug this into the 110 outlet All right, check the box here. Not the prettiest setup, but it's blue on standby. We can see it's lit up, the EV Goer logo. So we'll go ahead and grab our charger. Take this cover off. There we go. And then we'll go over to the car and plug it in. See if we can get it to charge. Open this door up. And then you're, you're gonna wanna push this in really hard until it clicks to make sure it's functioning properly. There we go, this thing pops up, you know you're good. Okay, I heard a beep, the little red charging indicator, and then it should show up on the screen. Nothing yet, let's go check and see what the box says. Okay, it's flashing green, which means we're charging. Sweet. Okay, here we go, 37%. Says we're gaining one mile per hour of range. Currently at 85 miles of range. Yeah, we're gonna leave this overnight and see what it looks like in the morning, how much range we can gain. I'm gonna turn it on real quick. So, 8.30 p.m let it sit for about 12 hours probably a little less and see what that looks like so we're at 85 miles of range 37 percent battery life and we'll take a look in the morning and see how much we've gained using this ev goer charger i'll put a link in the description to this thing if anybody wants to buy one off of amazon all right so it's the next morning about 8 a.m. Let's see what kind of charge we got overnight. 49% and 129 miles of range. So up about 12% and 44 miles overnight in about 11 hours or so. So not bad if that's all you need. This is an EV goer charger that plugs into a 110 or 240 volt outlet. I'll put the link in the description below if you're interested in checking one out. Thanks for watching and see you next time.